Hi guys, uh, welcome back to study. So today uh, I'm going to introduce you guys uh, a device that we call it multi-layer switch or in the abbreviation word is MLS. Okay, so this device is very special uh, because it can act as the router and switch at the same time and it's just uh, mostly people call it as a layer switch switch and the price is kind of expensive yes and um it's uh work is very great and high availability uh as you can see i have the uh create the lab here you can the big packet tracer that it provide the multi layer switch here so i got two multi layer switch here so uh, when we go to into the command line here as you can see uh, everything look like the switch okay I can create the VLAN okay for example VLAN 10 and I can have the uh, create the route uh, routing protocol dynamic routing protocol for example like router as you can see that I can uh, create the BGP EITOP OSPF and VIP something like that okay even the static routing uh, IP route something like that okay so um, I want to tell you that uh, if you want to do routing on this switch, uh, make sure you enable the IP routing command. Okay, IP routing on the switch. If you, if you want to do IPv6, you have to type IPv6 unicast. Uh, uh, IPv6. Uh, we don't have this command thing. All right. So maybe maybe this in the in the packet tracer, but uh, in the real switch, we we're gonna have the IPv6 unicast. Uh, command to end the board, uh, to, to, to end the board to do routing on the IPv6. So right now I'm going to demo you that I'm going to uh, end uh, board the FA0 slash one port here to be the route port. So as you can see, that if we go to FA0 slash one port here, I'm gonna type the IP address command, and it will not allow me to uh, uh, to type in. It say that unrecognized command because this is is still in the uh, uh, switch port. I mean the layer two port. So I'm going to convert this port into the layer 3 port uh, using the MLS uh, switch. Uh, my MLS switch using the command uh, no switch port. Okay. No switch port command and you can see that it's going to change to the route port and it can type IP address. Something like that. All right. Okay. First of all, I type 10 0 10 1 slash 30. Something like that. Okay. No set down. So here we go on uh, these two okay, I have to type an IP routing to enable routing interface F0 slash 1 here and no switch port I mean I'm going to disable the switch port on this interface and it's going to convert into the route port automatically IP address 10 2 something like that okay and then when I ping to the multi layer switch 1 uh, as you can see that the ping and the configuration uh, is the same as the router okay make so make sure the first thing you have to uh, enable IP routing to do the uh, dynamic routing some data or static route uh, static routing and if you want to change the port into the routing port you have to uh, uh, config no switch port on that interface particular interface yes and uh, we have a lot of uh, feature on that um, but I cannot describe all in just one video. So how you guys research more about that and I just introduced you about uh, the AMOLED switch. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you very much.